So, but here's my concern for, yeah. for the show, the Olympia. It's not so much the athletes. First of all, they didn't even get a chance to qualify. So that's this show. It would have to be an invite only, right? Exactly. Which is not fair. You know what I mean? Invite only. What is this new rule book? You know what I'm saying? It's not fair. I mean, tough all, times. You got to make up new rules. Yeah. I know. It's the, but still. But now, let this shit drag in and drag out. There's people that lost their job. There's people scared because they're scared of something that might not even be out there. Right. You know what I'm saying? So now let them. Let's say July. Everything should be supposed to go back to normal. The virus is not going to be gone. No. People just will be like, okay, but now by July, people will be so broke. How do you have an expo? When you expect and you rely on people traveling, we don't know about the travel bans. If there's still uh, viruses in the country, Trump ain't going to open up to that country. Right. So they're going to be travel bans, still restrictions. True. Where people can't, and people can't leave to be scared. That's why I'm already right now to have, have an uh, argument my venue in Germany to cancel my show in October. Wow. Yeah, because because here is simply because what if the, the health ministry says, OK, you can have thousand people again. But that time athletes can give up their preparation. Mm. They can't travel. Now I'm sitting there with the venue that cost me 50,000 plus all the other. Right, right, right. And I, and I have 12 athletes that came from the garage. <laughs> it's not it's not going to be worth yeah, it. Yeah. It's going to be. So what do you think, they're gonna push the, you think they'll push the Olympics at the end of the year? What do you think they'll do? Well, for June, I'm going to. Uh, oh, do you mean the Olympia? Yeah. Well, I don't. I, I don't. I don't know if it's possible to push it to the end of the year. Why? You know what I mean? Because you need sponsors. You need vendors. No, I know. You know. So you think they'll just? You, can't, you think it'll just people. get canceled then? Is what can you, you say? Yeah. Dave, Dave, can you imagine how hard it is to get a vendor to commit right now? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I would, I wouldn't want to. I mean, the only thing I would really sponsor is a live stream, right? Because I mean, that's something that you can, anyone can do, right? So, so, so think about it. Right now, you can't find a sponsor to commit or give you any a, a dollar. But, but remember who owns the Olympia now? I know, but what is that your goal to fucking lose? $10 Jake Wood, he'll let you. Know, he might want to put this show on anyway. I don't know. He might take out and come out of his pocket with it. Well, he might want to do it like Dana White, get it on an island, put it on a, on, a, on an island. There you go. And 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 let or let these guys just compete without without audience. If go to Iowa, it, the okay. cornfields of Iowa, and hold it. You know, build a, a stadium yeah. there. You know. <laughs> I, I I just believe the the Olympia is, is is the biggest event in the world. Yeah. And you know, where you rely on sponsors, vendors, and a sponsor, if they can't have an expo, what are you going to do? I, I understand, but it's 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 shame if we would lose a whole bodybuilding season, you know, a whole yeah, Olympia. A potential but, Mr. Olympia but, is not going to be crowned this year, yeah. you know. But it's not because the federation sucks; it's because of the virus. No, I, I mean, know. I, of we, course, I not, know. I understand. We, this is this is, this is not up to us. I mean, yeah. you know, this whole whole to twenty twenty is going to suck. Yeah, it started off with a bang. It's going to suck ass. <laughs> I said, I said, no, it's going to suck. I for feel me. bad for the That's athletes. For sure. I'm glad I'm not competing anymore. But I, yeah. I do feel bad for yeah. the athletes. I know how much I wanted to do. But I, you know, I was talking to Chris Bumstead and Ian Valier the other day, and you know, I said, you know, for a bodybuilder, we don't care as bodybuilders as long as we can train. If we have, if we can find a gym to train at, bodybuilders don't care if they have to take a whole season off because. As long as they can get to the gym and make improvements, they'll just see it as, oh, I got a little extra time now to get ready for next year. You know, that type of thing. Right, so. right, right. Yeah, it's it's hard now, man. And I, 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 I hope it's not happening, but I have a feeling that there's a good chance of all this being postponed yeah. and canceled. Look mm-hmm. how many shows are canceled. Even Jim's show in Pittsburgh's canceled. You know what I mean? There's, sure. What are you going to do? Yeah. You can postpone, you can postpone, but you don't know if you can really have it on that right. day. Right. I, I just know. because you... Just because you postponed it, you know, like the New York Pro is postponed. Yeah, I was August. going to say that. Yeah, August. Yeah. What guarantee do you have that it's going to be okay in August? 